Okay. This video will be very quick, hopefully, because it's going to be my last video for today. Hey, hold up, why is there one in red? Is that something I just noticed? Okay, so he's in a nursing room. Yes, that's what you should probably tell him what happened. Okay. We'll give him the pearl necklace, because you got to give Cecil some type of incentive to continue this journey. So there was like a key on her necklace. Wait. No, well, this game looks better visually this time than when I've last looked at this game. I don't know, I guess I appreciate the color palette a lot more. <laughs> Look at that jackass. Does Sid have a theme song in this game? Because <laughs> I know his Final Fantasy VII theme song was easily my favorite theme song for any character in this game franchise. What is that his theme song in this game? <laughs> what a badass. Even now that we can't put him in our party, he's still the shit. Still the coolest character in this game. Besides Golbez and Kane and Cecil. Okay, he's just the coolest one that isn't clad in tons of armor. Why is she getting sentimental all of a sudden? <laughs> Nigga was in bed and he knocked out. They played some sentimental ass music as if he just croaked out of the blue. Does this game have to tr make everything seem dramatic? Or have some type of melodramatic tension? Not everything needs it, guys. Even if it is just going to be ironic, self-deprecating you know, humor and comic relief. It's still stupid as fuck, boy.
or another one of these. So now we got a full range of motion here. That, that's really good. What's that cave over there? No, we ain't ready for that shit. A sweet ass fantasy, but it ain't gonna happen. Now, this is a place we need to go to. This town right here. Okay, well, that's an item shop. We should have probably went to the big chocobo, but. Now that I think about it, cure ones are useless in this game at, at this point. I'm going to weapon shop. It even says in, yet I'm so directionally confused that that's not enough for my ass. So which is better, a short bow or the archer? I'm gonna get the archer shit with... Is that going to be good? Yeah, we got a lot of useless ass weapons, but... Good thing is we got a ninja with me, with us, so... We could still put some use to that. We gotta update Kane's repertoire to our Dwarf X Windship Legend. Yeah, that's good. We should probably stuck with that for him. Let's talk to some of the NPCs. I mean, I like the greenish color palette of this stage. I mean, this town. Because it reminds me of, like... Modern graphics, these big ass engines, and these boring ass colors. Who needs a defense? Cecil needs a defense.
Yeah, we just wasted our money. That was one point. See, this is why I'm so skeptical of buying items around in this game. Because not a lot of things in this game are worth it. Okay, let me scroll up. This is all spoiler shit right now. Okay, so that's probably what you should have got. <laughs> Shit. A chain whip for Rydia. That would probably help Rydia be a lot more useful. Nah, we do need, like, do we? I don't know. Oh, fuck it. Okay, where's our next destination? Hope this directionally confused mofo. Oh, and there's some treasure chests we can raid. If I see treasure chests, I'm gonna raid it. The upper world. Uh, this game has mole men, and I love this game for that reason alone. Yeah, there are some cool stuff here. Is that all though? Is this it? Alright, I'm not even going to show the cave part. That's going to be for another day. This has been Mr. Wonka 7, and suck a nigga's dick.